Welcome back to Skin Slappers. And in today's episode, we're slapping some skin. Stop it! That hurts! I know, that's why I switched to your leg, because it's hurting my leg. <laughs> <laughs> well, fuck you. Here at Skin Slappers, we only provide the highest of slapping skin experience. Dude, you have... Are you sunburnt? No, you were slapping my leg! No, your arm. Are you wearing sunscreen every day, like I said? Uh, no. You know melanoma runs in our family. Yeah. So why aren't you wearing sunscreen every day? I'm serious about this. Uh, to rebel against my dad. Everybody, please comment in the comment section at Cooper the seriousness of melanoma, especially in redheads, and that he needs to be wearing sunscreen every day because if he died of melanoma, it would be stupid. Um, That's what I would say. Everybody, in, in I'd say what an idiot. Everybody, respect that I will block you from commenting on any further no, videos. No, I'll unblock you. I can log in anytime I want. I can, I can lock Molly out of the Ginger Snaps no, YouTube. No, you can't. It's attached to my phone number. I'm gonna go switch it. You can't do that. Yep, I'm gonna. All right, you I'll understand. I'll make a new rival YouTube. I'll <laughs> 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 do Ginger Snap. Ginger Snap. And and it's gonna say now with no melanoma. Cool. Seriously. And uh, no videos, because hey, you can't edit those. Look me in the eye right now. No. Oh my god! <laughs> I know that we're on air right now, but I'm serious. You're so important to me, and if you got sick because you're not wearing sunscreen, it would break my heart. Can you please wear sunscreen? No. When you mow the lawn today, will you wear sunscreen? No. Oh my god. Sorry. I can't work on like this. I'm just a rebellious boy. No, you're not rebellious, you're stupid. I'm rebellious. And a boy. Oh my god. Are you? Yeah. <laughs> Want me to prove it? No. Well, first no, of I'll all, take your word for very it. problematic that you assumed that I would prove my uh, manhood by revealing an organ that does not determine my gender. I didn't assume gender. that. I took your word so, for it. So, pretty problematic. If somebody told me what their gender was, I'd take their word for it. I'm just gonna show you my driver's license. I was questioning whether you're not rebellious. Oh, uh, sure. <laughs> That's what they want you to think. Who? The people. Come on, we're really falling apart here, and we've still got quite a few episodes left. Well, then maybe you should start buttering the pan. What? I don't know, man. Please, get it together. <laughs> get it together. Yeah, if we have an off day, it's an off day. But for the viewers, it's like... An off week? Man, the ginger snaps have sucked for the past four weeks now. <laughs> like, <laughs> exactly. Like, they're, they've been funny, like, since like June. For, like, a month. Yeah. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> that sucks. Ugh. Well, that's why we can't, like, have... <laughs> why would you run into that? That's why we can't have dogs, like, barking in the background, because for us, it's just like, okay, a couple episodes, but for the viewers, it's, okay, for the past month, there have been dogs barking in every episode of Ginger Snaps. When Spots. will our trial end? Is that an iron knuckle? No, it's a dark nut. Okay. Idiot. Wow, my bomb didn't even blow him up. I'm an idiot. Yeah, because that bomb was just a distraction. No, it didn't distract me at all. It sure did. Subtly. Wouldn't <laughs> expect you to understand. I with your obnoxious nature. Stop calling me names. Uh, Lucy. Ha! <laughs> that was a name. Wow, this episode is not funny anymore. Michelle. Michelle. Okay, now it's funny again. That's a funny <laughs> name. <laughs> okay, we're out of here. What's the funniest female name you can think of? Hmm. Hmm. That was a weird I think stint Molly in Ann is pretty fucking ridiculous. That's fair. Like. You also have two first names. No, I don't. No middle name. I think it was John Cooper. Well, Cooper's a last name. No, it's not. Your first Almost name is Almost every John single Cooper. Cooper I've met in my life, it's been their last name. Yeah. And we have a brother named Parker, which is also a last name. Wait, are we saying our Parker's name on air? Yeah. I normally just call him my older brother. You know, we've called him on the show. Oh, yeah. <laughs> During Minecraft. I, the other day somebody said, they were like, learning the Molly Ann lore, like, you have a brother? And I was like, well, I hope no. you're sitting down. Because <laughs> I have two. Whoa. <laughs> One of them's older. I've had him since I was born. Learning the Ginger Snaps lore, uh, Molly Ann does have a brother. I have two brothers and two sisters. Wow. 
and they're both wonderful and intelligent and sexy. You said they're both? Yeah. So only two. Yeah, I'm letting you guess. <laughs> well, obviously I'm the sexy one. Okay. So that means wonderful and intelligent are two others, so I'm leaving one sibling out. Yeah. It's Bree. Yeah. Can't stand her. <laughs> Bree sucks. Bree's got a terminal case of Breeitis. Breeitis. Her bedroom's above the ceiling. Do you think she can hear us? I hope she can hear us. I hope Bree knows what we're saying about her. I hope Bree knows that she's a waste of skin. Hey, that got too mean. <laughs> she's great skin. I'm jealous of it. My phone! Wow. I've been using Oh, it's cracked. I'm oh, kidding. <laughs> what? I was like, there's no way. This phone sucks in every way, except it never breaks. Oh, I love these dudes. Is that his brother? Yeah. Yeah. The angsty one. We met the first one on uh, Windfall. No, not on Windfall Island. On, uh, you know, where the bird people are. The Rito Island. Bird people? Uh, Valu. That's pretty fucked up. Valu's what there. The hell? What's it called? Dragon Roost Island. Dragon Roost Island. Island. Yeah, we met the first one there, so this is his brother. It'd be like naming our island. Uh, people, people island. Uh, human, human house island. <laughs> Now that sounds talk. like Cuban House Island. And what an I? No one's ever been able to spot me in there before. We got you. It's because we have the soul of the hero in us. Yeah. Ooh, we're gonna learn a new I'm song, right? Because I'm with the essence of heroicness. Down, right, left, up. What was it? Down, right, left, up. No. Cooper. No. Cooper, you're really bothering me. Reminding me of he who shall not be named that I'm not friends with anymore. There's this guy I'm not friends with anymore. Okay. <laughs> <He's>... <laughs> you could have just said there's this guy, I think. <laughs> Context. Anyway, we would be driving around and I'd be giving him directions because he'd be visiting me in town and I'd say, you're going to want to turn right here and he'd just go left. And it'd be on a, <laughs> a, like, it'd be like, now it would take us, because the way he went in traffic, it's going to take us ten more minutes. And I'd be like, why do you do that? He'd be like, <laughs> I just hate following directions. Like, he was so quirky. And I was like, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> what a quirky boy. I know. God, it drove me crazy. Okay. Who does that? Okay. I'm not just thinking about it. Okay. Ooh! Okay. We're not friends anymore. Not because of that. I actually continued to put up with that. Wow. <laughs> there were many other that things. That shows what you, you'll tolerate. <laughs> yeah. Shows how easily abusable you are. No. I'm just... Lazy, I guess. Yeah. Too lazy to cut people out. <laughs> Man, what a hassle. <laughs> Look at that sharky boy. Go get him. I'm trying. Go faster, Dad! <laughs> Give him power. The, slow down. The power of love. <laughs> Made him faster. So if you slow down, the shark slows down. Then when you speed up, the shark's like, oh! Oh, uh, <laughs> He's so tired. We're persistence hunting him. <laughs> he's so messed up. Come on! Does this make you go faster? Oh, because you get a little boost, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. We're gonna have some illegal shark fin soup for dinner tonight, boys! Hell yes. I don't think you're gonna catch them. That's fine. We're about to reach the minefield. Oh. To blow himself that up. That doesn't sound good. We want the soup to be cooked, don't we? <laughs> wanna go to a minefield? Uh oh! Whoa! Where is it? Don't go to the minefield! Oh my god! What's happening? <laughs> It's like a Michael Bay film right now. <laughs> I think I jumped the shark on Ooh. that one. Oh God! <laughs> you deserve that. I found him. You deserve to get eaten by a shark. Smile, you son of a. <laughs> Got him. Blew up. Hey, one of those something spooky I found out. What? So, <laughs> cannibalism when you were lost at sea was so acceptable and like as part of life at sea that it was just called the custom of the sea well that's what like every cartoon and movie is yeah ever done. well there was this case where these guys were lost at sea for so long and one of them was dying he was effed the others might have had two or three more days he he did not 
And so they're like, we gotta kill him again. And drink his blood. And, um... I don't think blood is very hydrated. It is. It really? Is. Yeah. So, they did. And this was always totally acceptable. This happened, these guys were from, from actually Falmouth and Cornwall. And, um, this was totally, like, when they came, when they got rescued, they came home, they were like, yeah, we had to eat him. But he was dying every, anyway. And everybody's like, yeah, that happens. Well, wow. for the first time ever, English lost. And you know what? No. You're going on trial <laughs> for murder. And people couldn't believe it to the point that the older brother of the guy they ate defended them in court. I mean, yeah. He was like... At a certain yeah, point, the law was, of the land kind was, of has to get he set was a, aside. He was a sailor, too. And he was like... I know that sailors have to do this in times of desperation. He's like, they told me my brother was unconscious and not going to wake up, and I believe them. And yeah. I... Because who's just going to do yeah, that? Yeah, and he was like, and I would have done the same. <laughs> He's like, they ate my brother, and so would I have. And I just think that's crazy because, like, I think it's interesting because it it doesn't happen very often anymore. And... If it, oh yeah, if it did, it'd be so bonkers. So, now, I don't think it would be like that. I don't think the public, like, the public might defend them, but a lot of people would be like, they should have all starved, like, before they did that. It, I can't imagine being in a culture at the time where it was just, like, his his brother was like, hey guys, yeah. you're good. Like, you know, like, I don't, even if I forgave them, because I was like, they had to, I don't think I could have, like, hung out with them, but... <laughs> Because every time I saw them, I'd be like, man, you ain't Cooper. <laughs> like, yeah. All right. <laughs> well, then. <laughs> anyway, I'm just that's saying. That's all. If we have to eat someone while we're out here with our boat dad. <laughs> if our boat dad has to eat us, that's the custom of the I sea. I think he's a boat. <laughs> that's the custom right. of the sea. That's all. We'll see you guys <laughs> next time.